So we're blending the 15 gallons of Syrah in the glass, gigantic glass bottle with the 30 gallons in the blue plastic container with another 50 or 53 gallons in there. And we're putting that into two containers here. I'm not sure you can see the level there. Two of these. The idea being to get one consistent wine that you can that we can then bottle. And we'll pump that upstairs after we're done. There's a plastic hose going from now to plastic. It used to come from through the pump. And back into the barrel. Plastic barrel. This is how blending needs to be done. <laughs> Up close and personal. We're blending about five gallons of uh, Zinfandel into our into our 50 gallons each of Syrah to increase the acid and the complexity of the Syrah. Okay, here comes our pump on again. Here's our little pump. And then we're pumping into the carboy. That's an easiest way to measure how much uh, we're adding is to pump it into a glass container where you can see the level. If you wanted to keep the uh, Zinfandel for less than 10 percent of the volume of the Syrah. Here's the Syrah here, one of the containers. That's what about 50 gallons of Syrah looks like. Just prior to putting it into bottles. Nice landing. So now the wine is blended into these two containers and we're pumping it using our trusty pump through a hundred feet of food grade tubing from the cellar through my house and out to my front driveway where we're going to do the bottling tomorrow. bottles. Mike Miller, my nephew. He's the president of Raycon. Dvorak, write a new world symphony. Yeah. 